everyone, welcome back to my channel. So, today I finally decided to do a makeup collection. Uh, my cousin asked me to do one, and I'm moving out, well not moving out of this apartment, but I'm moving back home for the summer. Uh, so I decided that this would be a good time to finally film like a makeup collection. And I do have a lot of makeup, but a lot of it I honestly need to get rid of, I've had for years. Um, and I just really like makeup, I like collecting makeup. But uh, yeah, I think I might be changing the setup soon, like when I move back um, after summer, I think I might be getting a new desk or something, something with a lot more space. So I decided to film like this setup and show you guys, because I do think it's really cute and I'm really excited because I've never had a vanity before because back at home I just didn't have space for one. So this is the first time I've ever had like my own space for my makeup, so this is really exciting. Uh, yeah, so I'm just gonna go ahead and show you my makeup collection. Okay, so this is my little makeup corner. I do my hair right there with my full length mirror and then I just have my vanity right here. And eventually I'm going to get a bigger desk. Actually, um, I'm going back home soon for the summer. So I think I'm going to bring this with me back home and then uh, I'm going to look for like an L-shaped desk because this is the only like table I have in my apartment. So it's like my dining table and my desk and my vanity. So I love it but it's really small and when you're drawing on this, since I'm in art school, it's really rough because it's wood. So I just need something that's smoother and just a little bit more convenient. Yeah, so starting off, this chair is from Home Goods. And then this thing on it is like this big fluffy jacket I got from American Eagle and it's like the best thing ever. It's like almost like a robe, it's giant. And then this desk, which I love, is from um, 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 TJ Maxx. And then above it is this bulletin board that I made from a giant picture frame from Walmart. I just really liked the design on it, but I did not like the color, it was brown, so I just took spray paint and spray painted it. And then for like the picture, I put um, corkboard in it. So now it's a bulletin board. And I just have like pictures from prom and little things that I've done and like notes that my boyfriend's wrote me, wrote me, written me. <laughs> and, um, and then I have a list that I made of like cruelty free makeup brands um, because I'm trying to switch all my makeup to cruelty free. So yeah, now moving on to my actual makeup collection. Okay, so over here is where I have my mirror where I do my makeup. And I really like this mirror, it's from TJ Maxx. I just really like how it like twists right here. It's really dirty and I've had it for a long time, but I think it's really cute. And then, starting over here, I have a scrunchie because it doesn't put like a dent in my hair when I wear it at night. Um, and then I have this Vanilla Bean Noel um, lotion. Over here is where I have all of my setting sprays. I have the Mario Badescu, Badescu, um setting sprays. I have both of them. I don't know if they're setting sprays, but more of just like skincare. Um, I have the rose one and the green tea, no, tea tree one. And then I have back here setting sprays I don't really use that much. This is like a brush cleaner. Um, and then this is probably my favorite setting spray at the moment. It's the Wet n Wild setting spray and yeah I think those all look really pretty right there especially these two and then I have a random primer right here from elf which I don't know how I feel about yet I'm just still trying it out and then this really cute makeup bag that my cousin got me when she went to Paris she got it from the Eiffel Tower I believe and I think it's the prettiest cutest thing I've ever seen and I just like have had it ever since she gave it to me like two years ago and I actually have confetti in here from like all the concerts I've been to like Ariana Grande and Taylor Swift which is kind of funny but yeah, I just keep that back there. Then right here is where I have all of my everyday makeup or makeup I just want to start using more. So some of the stuff isn't stuff I use every day, like these um, Kylie Jenner lip things that I got from the Valentine's Day collection. I don't wear those every day, I just want to start wearing them more. And I think they're really cute, so I just keep them out. Um, as well as this Wet n Wild liquid lipstick, which I like a lot. And then I have the Gimme Brow from Benefit, which is my favorite brow product ever. I'm trying to find like a dupe for it that's cruelty free, so... If you know of any, let me know. And then over here, I have like concealers that I've been using. One from Wet n Wild, which I like a lot. Um, my favorite one from Maybelline. And then I have some lip liners, a, another Benefit Brow product, and some eyeliners. This is my favorite eyeliner right now. It's the Wet n Wild Skinny Eyeliner. And back here, oh, I have the um, It Cosmetics CC Cream, which I've been trying out. I got a little sample size of that. And then I have the Chocolate so Soleil Bronzer from Too Faced. And then I have my favorite highlighter, which is the Champagne Eyeshadow from CoverGirl. And the Wet n Wild Ombre Blush, which I have been trying out. 
Then over here is the mascara I'm using currently, which is the Wet n Wild Skinny Mascara. I like that a lot. And then the Urban Decay Primer Potion in Sin. I think this is really pretty if you just like don't want to wear eyeshadow and you just want to put this on. And yeah, that's it for like my everyday kind of makeup or makeup I just want to start wearing more. And then over here is where I have, well right here I have a moisturizer. And then back here I have a bunch of brushes I really never use. I just kind of have and honestly should get rid of. Um, and then I have eyelash curler and a beauty blender which is really dirty and I really need to get a new one but I have that there. And then I have some ColourPop, an eyeshadow, and a highlighter. These are really pretty. I just don't wear them enough, so I try to keep them out, so I wear them more. And then back here, I have a Milani kind of like brow pomade, um, a Makeup Forever HD powder, uh, a Wet n Wild like cushion thing, and then an e.l.f. setting powder. So I just have those all stacked there just because I use them a lot of the time. And I just thought they all like neatly stacked and looked nice. Now over here is where I have my palettes, um, which I'll go through, and then my foundations. So starting off with my foundations, some of these are empty, like the Born This Way is empty, I should get rid of that. This is a little sample size of the Wet n Wild foundation, then the full size, which I don't really know how I feel about that, it's not really my color. Um, then I have my favorite foundation right now, which is the Neutrogena Healthy Skin Foundation. And then another one of my favorites, which is the Rimmel Match Foundation. And then another one that's like pretty much empty, which I got like a year ago, and that's the Makeup Forever Foundation. And over here is uh, an old candle that I recycled and made into a brush holder with some rice in it. And this is just where I keep all of my like everyday brushes, or just my favorite brushes. Alright, and now for all the palettes that I had over there. I have all the palettes that I use the most, or I just like want to start using more. And that's one of the little Kylie palettes from her Valentine's Day collection, which came with those two little liquid lipsticks. And then I have the Naked Basics, um, this like Makeup by Manny BH Cosmetics thing, which I honestly only have up because I love this color. It's really good for setting my, uh, or putting on before I put on eyeshadow. And then my favorite palette, which is the Sweet Peach. And then the Naked palette, which I'm pretty sure everybody who owns makeup owns. And then the um, holiday palette from Kylie. All right, so now I'm going into my drawer, which is a little bit disorganized. So starting off with this side, I just cleaned out, so it's a lot more organized. But I just have these three like Disney palettes from Elf, which I can't resist buying every time I see them at like Walgreens. I think they're the cutest things ever. Um, so yeah, I just have those, and then I have some like pens and pencils for school and a makeup bag and some bobby pins and hair ties and then these pins that i use to pin things up on my bulletin board moving on to this section this is stuff that like alternates between here like this is stuff i kind of use every day but i just kind of switch things out all the time so i just have it here so if i do want to use something here i can just open up my drawer and it's right there um so yeah this is just stuff that i kind of use every day and i'm kind of still trying out and this is as far as my drawer will pull out but uh, this is where I have all of my like other drugstore eyeshadows or like little drugstore palettes. Um, so I have some Wet n Wild ones, some Elf ones, some more of those like princess ones, um, and then some just like single eyeshadows from Sephora and stuff. And then I also have some more primers and some eyeliners and glitter and everything you could want for your eyes. And then the drawer right next to it is stuff that I really just don't use that often because either because I like don't like it and I just haven't gotten around to throwing it away or something like, you know, the Naked 3, which I love, but like I just don't use it every day so it doesn't need to be up there. Um, so yeah, this is just stuff I don't use that often and stuff I need to get rid of and I'm stuff I'm still contemplating if I like or not. Um, so yeah, that's kind of a boring drawer. And then under it is probably one of the most exciting drawers. It has all my lip products which I attempted to organize before this video, but it's still kind of a jumbled mess. I have some of my like, liquid lipsticks on here, some lip liners, some MAC lipsticks, uh, some NYX ones, my Revlon lip butters, and just, just really every brand. Uh, I have lots, lots, of, lots of lip products. So yeah, that's it for my makeup collection. All right, so that's it. That's that's my whole makeup collection. I really like um, filming these kind of videos and I love watching these kind of videos too. So if you wanna see anything else like this, like maybe an apartment tour, maybe a little bit later on because I still have stuff I need to do, um, I can do that too. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.